Hey, this is Ellie from Magic Beans, and in this video, I'm going to tell you everything you need to know about foam changing pads. Foam changing pads are super on trend right now. People are moving away from a traditional contour changing pad that have a soft cloth cover on it, which can get dirty and then you have to like wash it like a million times. But if you're considering a foam changing pad, this may be a game changer in terms of the way you set up your nursery. So I'm gonna show you three foam changing pads today. If you have any questions about them, you have to email me your questions to questions at beans.com. We're here to answer all of your questions about whether it's a changing pad or a stroller or a car seat. And remember, if you haven't seen the rest of our YouTube channel, go check them out. Check out our playlist. We have playlists on strollers and car seats and baby gear and toys. And we just want to help you figure out what baby gear is right for your family. Here is the comparison. I have three changing pads for you today. I have the Peanut Changer by Kikaru. I have the Maddie by Leander and the Bumbo changing pad. All very similar concepts, but they all have little differences and you may be wondering what are the differences. Well, let me start with the peanut changer. First of all, it's called the peanut changer because it's shaped like a peanut, duh. And it is the longest of the three that I'm going to show you. It's 31 inches long and it is 10 inches wide at the most narrow part part. Really cool, it's actually manufactured in America, in upstate New York, so it's completely made in the USA, and it has this Durasoft Dura foam, which makes it super soft for the baby to lie on, and it will be particularly good for changing a larger baby in addition to a smaller baby because it is 31 inches long. This has been one of our most popular products at mbeads.com for 2016, and it continues to be a super rock star in 2017. It comes with a strap included, which you'll just stick to the bottom, and then you can secure the baby while you're changing him or her. But remember, you always want to stay with your baby when you're changing them. You never want to walk away from the baby. Always keep a hand securing that baby. But we do have this extra um, strap for extra security. Now let's look at the Leander. The Leander is, in general, a great European brand. It's a Danish brand. And it is, they are known for making modern furniture that is kind of smaller for smaller spaces for city living. And the Leander changing pad is just really sleek, really beautiful. Comes in four different colors. It comes in this gray, but it also comes in a light blue, a navy, and a pink. And you can see the this really sleek shape, very simple. Um, for your house, if that's sort of, sort of your design. Um, the thing I like about this pad is that though you can change the baby perpendicularly, if you have a setup where you're facing the baby, you can actually change facing the baby versus sort of some awkward perpendicular changing. Um, nice and big, it's not as long as the peanut changer. It is only 27 inches long, but it is 18 inches wide. So you can change the baby and put maybe some of your supplies for uh, changing baby next to the baby, if that's how you're setting up your changing station. It's made from a medical grade polyurethane, so it's super safe and super soft for baby and easy to clean. Both with the Maddie and with the peanut changer, it has really good tread on the bottom, so it doesn't actually move around. It sort of sticks, and while your baby's in there, it's not going to shuffle around or move at all. The Leander also comes with a strap, and it's really easy to manage. You just put the strap right under the ch changer, and boom, clip your baby, really easy. Finally, we have the Bumbo. Uh, the Bumbo is the least expensive of the three, but it is also the smallest. It is only 26 inches long, so it's, you're not gonna be able to change as large a baby on the on the Bumbo. You may be familiar with the Bumbo brand from those Bumbo, seat, those Bumbo seats, which help a baby sit up when they're only three months old before they could actually sit. If you want to see the Bumbo, it's available right there at mbeads.com. You can check it out. But the difference between this, besides being smaller, is it doesn't have that great tread on the bottom, so it will slide around a lot more. And it has its strap sort of attached, so you don't have to put it under, but it just kind of comes out of the box like this. The Bumbo changer is also available in a variety of colors, which you can see at mbeans.com. Now you may be wondering, like I said, you're gonna be changing not as large a child than the Bumbo versus the Leander or the Kikaru. How long are you gonna change a baby? Well, it really depends on your parenting style. Some people are able to get those 
babies, elimination, communication, get those babies not out of diapers really, really fast. But some people, like my kids, some of my kids were in diapers past three years old. So you may be changing a baby even after three. So that's just something to consider when you are looking at a changing pad. Again, all three of these, very durable, very cleanable, very soft, and they'll look great in your nursery. And the best part, no extra laundry, which I am super thrilled about. Now, if you have any questions about these three changers or any other piece of baby gear, you can email me your questions to questions at mbeans.com. We're here to answer all of your questions about baby gear. Now, if you like this video, and I hope you do, please give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you want to see a behind the scenes look at what we do here at Magic Beans, follow us at mbeans.com on Snapchat. And finally, if you have any friends who you think would find this video valuable, please share it. We really appreciate it. Thank you so much for watching.